Hey YouTube, this is Wesley with Wesley Ball Pythons and today I wanted to do a video uh, addressing or talking about one of the many reasons why I keep ball pythons and I like ball pythons and I'm sure a bunch of uh, ball python owners would agree with a lot of the things that I would say. This particular video um, is focused on their personalities and um, you know particularly how docile they are and, and how they serve as ideal pets and the motivation for, for this video came from a TV show that I uh, was watching the other night and they had this competition where the contestants had to dig into a snake pit, dangerous snake pit, um, to obtain these rewards. All of the snakes in this dangerous snake pit were uh, essentially ball pythons. I think there was maybe one or two uh, reticulated pythons, uh, but they were primarily ball pythons. And it was just hilarious to see how the um, contestants were all frightened of them and so forth. And so it just kind of ticked me off, you know. And so I wanted to put together a video to kind of display how they really are and so forth. And so I'm going to do that with this video. Okay, so I've just taken one of my ball pythons, um, Kyrie, out of his rack and I'm taking him out of his tub. I was actually in the, the middle of doing their daily routines when I decided, hey, let me just go ahead and shoot this video. So I'm taking him out. Um, his rack's rack is um, the rack that I'm changing their waters today and so that's why I have him out and as you can see um, he did not bite me he did not attempt to bite me he's just kinda hanging out and um, as I go through my routine of you know um, spraying down their tubs to make sure their humidity is right. I just kind of let these guys hang out with me, you know, which is one of those characteristics that people like about pets, being able to cuddle with them. In a lot of ways, you can think of it as me kind of cuddling with this guy. And then just look at that pretty puppy dog face that he has. Wouldn't hurt a fly. I've had Kyrie for five years now and He's just an awesome snake that is just curious and awesome ball python. Curious, not attempting to hurt me in any way, just kind of comfortable with me and hanging out with me. Nothing to be afraid of. It was so funny. So this guy's going to hang out with me. Wow. I kind of do my thing so so what I do to make sure their tubs are as humid as I need them to be is I just kind of spray down their substrate check for any messes that they may have made and so forth and you can see I mean this is my normal routine I just kind of let them hang out with me while I go through this process. Again, he's just hanging out, chilling. Sometimes they will go about their own little way and, and go through the room, explore the room while I'm doing this. And I just kind of keep an eye on them so they don't get into any crevices or anything like that that will cause them harm. But, but as you can see, you just kind of doing his thing again nothing to be afraid of he's kind of chilling and part of this routine 
is really that this routine is kind of relaxing for me. In some ways, it's like gardening. I just kind of spray this down. And then once it gets nice and wet, I'll stir it up and then spray it down again. And again, you see Kyrie's just kind of moseying around, checking things out. I'm not a threat to him. He's not a threat to me. And we just kind of do our thing. So. I'm going to spray this down one more time. Meanwhile, just keeping an eye on Kyrie, make sure he doesn't get into anything that would be problematic. But he's not a threat to me and I'm not a threat to him. It's a great pet owner pet relationship. And just about all of my ball pythons are this way. And yes, I have multiple ball pythons. And in a different video, I'll talk about why I choose to have so many. So. Can you guys still see Kyrie? He's out in the background. Again, just minding his own business. Now see, now he's going into this little crevice. And I don't want him to go in there, so I'm gonna stop him from heading in that direction. Again, no endangerment to me or to him. Just hold on to him for a second while I finish this up. Look at that. The big bad snake. Yep. I am so frightened. He's probably going to eat my head off. Not. It really is amusing how people are so afraid of ball pythons. They kind of lump them in with snakes. And yeah, there are some snakes that you should fear because they're dangerous, because they're venomous. Um, he is not one of them, nor are any of his fellow species members. Get a smile for the camera. Kyrie, can you give us a smile for the camera? There we go. That's pretty much it for this video. Um, but again, you know, just kind of like hanging out with these guys. They are not a threat whatsoever. And just wanted to kind of show that off with one of my oldest ball pythons, Kyrie. So, thank you Kyrie for tolerating me and being the star of this video. If you like the video, please consider subscribing so that you can see more cool videos like this and see more of Kyrie and, and some of his other Wesley ball python friends. And that's gonna be it for this video. If you liked it, go ahead and hit the like button and enjoy the rest of your day.